to re we're going to be revamping or remixing uh existing dollar tree wall art um here's one of the pieces i love it it's beautiful but what i want to do is make the flowers more pink to me they're kind of peachy pink there is some pink there but to me it's mostly pink and i don't it's like a burgundy reddish color um i want pink to stand out and i might add some glitter to it and then this is a piece, both of these pieces I hauled a while ago. I'm trying to get these done so I can hang them because that's part of my organization was putting away, sorting through all the Dollar Tree hauls. Um, <laughs> I need to stop. I really do. Um, and this is not even, this is just one area. Okay. I got to go upstairs and then I got to go to my car. Okay. I don't know what's going to be out there. Okay, um, in my trunk area. <laughs> but anyway, this I want to add more pink to. I want to um, minimize the blue. So we're going to be doing that. And we're going to be doing that with uh, the paint from Dollar Tree. Okay, here is a white and red jot that I used to mix some pink. And this is something that I hauled. Um, last week I hauled this uh, paint in white and black and I said I wish I, I they had more colors well I found more colors and this is one of them and I think I'm going to use this one on this piece I'm also going to be creating an eye you see how they have an eyebrow I'm going to be creating an eye and I'm going to give her some lashes y'all I'm going to try listen I'm going to try y'all know I'm extra so uh we're going to try that okay but I'm going to start with the easy one first and that's this one the perfume bottle because i have done that already to existing pieces just add more pink to it and listen before i tried this previously i would have passed on these pieces saying well they don't match but i want to show you guys if you see a piece you like and you say oh i wish it was this color or i wish it had this color in it i'm going to show you how you can add to existing dollar tree wall art to make it look the way you want it to look and i have done it all in this room i have done that some pieces i have been lucky on i haven't had to do anything to but then there's some pieces that i have revamped okay so i'm starting with the easy one like i said i already mixed some white and red paint um this is the regular acrylic paint um from jot from dollar tree if you have other paint do your thing and all I'm going to be doing, and start just with a little bit of paint. I'm just going to look at the flowers and see where I want to add the pink. Um, and I don't have to do all the flowers, okay? I can leave some as they are. Okay? I can leave some of them as they are. I'm using these brushes that I told you guys aren't the best. Um, but I don't wash them. I throw them out when I'm finished with them. I don't even try to save them. Again, we don't have to do all the flowers. Um, we can just do some. And I think I'm going to add glitter to it. It's hard to... I was hoping with this tripod you'd be able to see closely. But as you can see... I'm working on this flower right here and I'm just making it more pink. Again, I don't mind, I just, it just was too peach for me, you know what I mean? And it's very simple. You just stay within the lines. 
this way it will be no doubt that pink belongs in um, this picture. I really like this picture. I really like Dollar Tree wall art. Not like, love. Otherwise, I hope you guys had a good week. I hope you guys are safe. Family's healthy. You guys are staying healthy. I gave up on this, uh, hoping that the quarantine will end. I think he keeps saying two more weeks, two more weeks, so people won't go crazy. Two more weeks sounds better than August 1st. Two more weeks sounds better than September 1st. Again, which flower did I just do? I just added more pink to that flower. Okay, and then just keep going around where you want to add the pink or the color of your choice. It doesn't have to be pink. You might want to add blue flowers. Whatever colors you want to add, go ahead and do your thing. Go ahead and do your thing. You don't need a lot of paint. This pink right here that I have will be enough to do this flower. And again, remember I told you I want to add some glitter. I'm going to add some glitter to this. Okay. As you can see, just got to see which way you I added pink to that. Now, I'm not doing the whole flower, but I'm doing enough where you'll know. Okay. Because I do think a color is not... A natural flower is not one solid color. It um, could be different colors. You know what I mean? So I don't want to go crazy. I just want to get rid of some of that peachy color. You know what I mean? Like, for instance, this flower. Okay? I want to make that flower more pink. I got this glitter from Michaels. Okay? And good old Dollar Tree Mosh Posh. So um, I'm going to mix this together get a clean brush, and then I'm going to uh, add the glitter to the areas that I want. I'm going to do it with the brush because this paint is still wet, so the glitter will cover, you know, stick to the wet paint, and I don't want that. I also have my handy-dandy Dollar Tree fan. I love it. Um, you could use this for your nails. You could use this for um, when you put on your eyelashes. You know, so the glue will dry faster, okay? I'm just going to let the fan run over this for a little bit um, because I do not want the glitter just to stick to anything that's wet, okay? Um, I'm doing this for time purposes. If it wasn't for the time purposes, I would just let it air dry, okay? Okay, just put some Mod Podge and some glitter in here. This dries fast, guys. And for, to me, when everybody else mixes the glitter with the Mosh Posh, it always comes out better than when I do it. I don't know if I'm not adding enough um, glitter. I don't know, but it always comes... Oh, that was too much freaking glitter. This is why I tell you guys, I don't like to do things on camera. That's too much glitter. Oh, God. Let me, let me get this together. But the extra glitter will not go to waste because I'm going to use it for uh, the next piece. But all I'm going to do is, and I'm not a professional crafter, guys. That's another thing. I'm not a professional crafter. Um, I think I'm creative. Or I have creative ideas. Now, executing them all the time, I'm not successful or as successful as I would like to be. But um, I try my best. And Now, this will dry clear. This will dry clear. I don't know. When I mix it together, it just doesn't come the way I want it to come, guys. So, maybe you guys know it better. I don't know. Maybe I'm not. I don't, I don't know. But this will dry clear. Before we move on... I am going to add some bling to the top of the perfume bottle. And I was going to do clear stones. I have these clear stones from Jot. I love these. But I want to add some gold because my colors from here are pink, gold, and black. So I want to use gold. 
and um, I think I might put a diamond in the center of each flower. I don't think so. I'm not going to do that. Um, but I am going to add some gold. And I am going to add a darker pink. Just a little bit. Just, just a little bit. Just stick with me, okay? Okay, we're starting this piece now. I'm gonna let that other piece dry um, and uh, let's get into it. Okay guys, I added the pink, but this is drying. I have to do another coat, okay? Um, what I'm doing now is I'm creating an eye. Her eye is going to be closed. So I had some Ioni lashes and um, that I hauled from Dollar Tree, and I just took one and I cut it because her eye is not going to be as big as mine or yours, okay? I didn't glue it down yet because I just want to place it. Again, remember her eye is closed, okay? If I could give you a look. And I even cut them down. Y'all know I'm a mess. Y'all know, so don't say, Erica, why are you doing that? Because y'all know I'm a mess. And um, that's just it. Now I found with these uh, brushes, if you cut them, you get rid of all those little wispy ones. It's annoying and it really messes up your work. So I think I might be able to work with these because all you gotta do is cut them. Where are you, camera? You see, to make them even, because the problem with these is they have all these loose wispy um, brush fibers and it messes up your work because it's very hard to paint within the lines with that. Now, all I'm gonna be doing is taking some Maj Posh and then I'm gonna fill that area in because I'm gonna give her a sparkly glitter eye look. 
So I have the Maj Paj and I'm just gonna paint her invisible eyelid. This Maj Paj is gonna dry, um, it's gonna dry clear. Oh God, maybe I shouldn't have did that. Excuse my language. Mm. I don't want the glitter on the lashes. I want the glitter on the eyelid. Great. I hate these because it's very hard to get the glitter out. Okay guys, we are finished and I wanna show you the perfume bottle. Now is there any doubt that this is paint? And I'm gonna come closer to you. I added the bling to the perfume bottle. I added a little bit of glitter to the bottom of the bottle and I added some glitter to the center of the flowers. I'm happy with the way it came out and you see how you can add color to existing Dollar Tree wall art and make it your own. So I'm very happy, thumbnail, with that one. Now my African Diva was a little bit harder, okay? It was a little bit harder to cover the darker color paint, okay? The blue and the purple and stuff like that. Um, I have one area that I have to fix, but I have to let it dry some. But here is this beautiful African Diva. You see I added an eyelash, okay? Gave her an eye, added some lashes. Um, I ended up adding some glitter to the pink parts that I painted because um, it just was hard to cover it. I did like three or four coats and all I did was just cover the necklace. I did not like the necklace and I just added a pink gem as you can see. Now tomorrow when it dries more, well, I'm gonna clean up this line along this but um, I'm happy with the way she came out and I think she's, um, she's good to go. She's good to hang up, okay? I wish I could cover more and add more pink, but it's just very tedious. And again, it's harder to cut. It's harder to cover the darker colors. I mean, I did lots and lots of coats, but um, this is my African diva. And again, don't be afraid. It's only a dollar. If you mess up, you mess up. But don't be afraid to try to transform some Dollar Tree wall art. I know I'm extra with the lashes, y'all, but I don't give a damn. But anyway, thanks for watching, and I will talk to you guys soon. I'm in the process of adding more pink, but look at her lashes, y'all. Look at her lashes. I'm thinking about giving her a nose ring.